Hello guys, so in this video I'm gonna show you how you can connect your Squarespace domain with your GoDaddy hosting. So first of all, you need to go on Squarespace and click on login. Here you need to enter your username and password and click on login. Now go on domain section. Select that domain which you want to connect with your GoDaddy hosting. Now came to GoDaddy, sign in, after login you will see this kind of screen, now just scroll it down and you will found a section for web hosting, make sure you purchase any web hosting plan from GoDaddy, otherwise this option will not appear to you and now just click on manage, click on cPanel admin search for domain click on create a new domain if you found your domain already added here you not need to do this step but if you did not found your domain on which you want to install a wordpress just click on create a new domain now copy your domain from squarespace and paste here uncheck this tick mark and click on submit. Once it submit, you successfully added your domain to your GoDaddy hosting. Now we need to connect our domain with GoDaddy hosting. Just click on cPanel and copy this shared IP address. Go back to your Squarespace account. Click on DNS. Click on edit record. If you did not found any option for edit record, you can add a new record, but I already have a, a record on my domain name. So just click on add it and paste that IP here and click on save. Once it's save, just refresh to check and match the IP with your cPanel. Both are same. So now it will take around four to six hour to connect your domain with GoDaddy hosting. If you want to connect your domain with GoDaddy with the name servers, you have to connect to GoDaddy customer support and ask them for your hosting name servers. After that, they will provide you your name servers. You just need to copy those name servers and go on your Squarespace account. Again, click on DNS, domain name servers, click on custom name servers and here, you can add those name servers but in 99% cases you don't need to add those name servers to your hosting just follow their steps which i mentioned around dns i hope you guys found this tutorial helpful make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel thanks for watching see you in next video